lot of really awesome beards in here tonight. Our bartender has a very amazing beard. You do too. <laughs> we are members of the Brotherhood Council of Beards. And we get together, guys, we get together on Wednesdays and we call each other's beards. It's really awesome. And we get 50% off at Jamba Juice. <laughs> Not a lot of, I mean, like, people, they want to grow beards, they just, they don't know the steps to go through to get it, you know? They don't have discipline, they'll make it about halfway through, and they'll just shave it off. But I've done the research, and I can tell you, step by step, how to go about achieving that full thickness. So first off, you get yourself into a committed, loving relationship, and then you get dumped. <laughs> And then you get in your car and you go to McDonald's and you go through the drive-thru and you order one McChicken and one McDouble. And then you park your car in their parking lot and you take the patty from the McChicken, sandwich it in between the patties of the McDouble, make sure you have the song Green Sleeves playing on a constant loop. <laughs> you lean back, you take a bite, and you just let the depression consume you. And the tears, they come, and they work like miracle grow. <laughs> But some people, they want beards, but they're not in committed loving relationships. Another thing that you can do, you can, you know, you can sit at home on your couch, blog about your cats, and scoop peanut butter out of a jar using potato chips. I recommend that you use ruffles, because ruffles have ridges. And then your neck's gonna have ridges, but you'll have that beard, so that'll cover them up just fine. <laughs> 